And today we have a brand new episode of Morphal to check out. So let's see it. There is no place in the world where it's more fun to climb trees than in the jungle. Right, Morphal? Too, so you two can become friends. Uh -huh. Crocodile, what's your wrong? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Crocodile, a toothache. We should help it by brushing its teeth. This is scary. Ah, look, Morphle. The crocodile was just losing a baby tooth. That's why it had a toothache. Now we can put the tooth right here and wait for the tooth fairy. This is such a long wait. Maybe the Tooth Fairy doesn't visit the jungle. Ah, oh, let's wait for just a little bit more. accidentally dropped this life ray that I was going to present at the National Science Conference, and it zapped your toy dinosaurs to life. But it broke, and I can't zap the dinosaurs back again. Hmm. Mila, can you look after them while I fix my life ray? Of course, Professor Rashid. I'm sure we'll have lots of fun together. Great. I'll be back as soon as I can. Toy dinosaurs, while we wait for the professor to return, let's play a game!
now let's play tag. You're it, T-Rex. Longer than expected, but it's fixed now. Let's go back to the toy dinosaurs right away. I hope nothing bad has happened while I was gone. Oh, tumbling test tubes! Professor, do you want to join the picnic? We've been having great fun! Thank you, Mila, but I think it's time to zap the dinosaurs back into toys. Steady. Oh! Professor Rashid, I don't think the toy dinosaurs want to go back to being toys. They've been having much more fun as living dinosaurs. Yes, Mila, but the city is no place for dinosaurs. Hmm. Oh, I have an idea. Maybe Zookeeper Kenneth has a place for them. What's this? Are those giant toy dinosaurs? Yeah, Professor Rashid accidentally zapped them with his life ray. Do you have a place for the toy dinosaurs to live, Zookeeper Kenneth? Well, the zoo only has one place for big animals, and the elephants already live there. But... During my travels, I think I spotted an uninhabited island where the toy dinosaurs could live. Let's go there right away, Morphle. There it is! You seem to have fun already. This island is a great home for you, but we need to go home again as well. Bye, toy dinosaurs! Get 
ball, too. Oh. Um, okay. We get the ball first, because we are big. Hey, you can't touch my hat, and you can't walk with the ball. That's against the rules. Well, we are pirates. We don't like playing by the rules. Hmm. Okay, but don't you want to play with our ball instead? I mean, maybe yours might get dirty. Yes. Hmm. Great point. Nice one, Phil. Huh? Close, but not good enough. You dropped it, Pirate Phil. It's not my fault the ball was like jelly. <laughs> Two points for us. fishy going on with that ball. I think it's Morpho, Pirate Maurice. What? But that's against the rules. You have to play basketball with a real ball. I thought pirates don't like playing by the rules. Well, we don't. But this is not fun at all. Maybe we should just play by the rules, Pirate Maurice. I guess cheating just isn't fun. Hmm. Okay. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. I like basketball. Oh, wow. This was fun. Yeah. Morphle, morph into an excavator. The yearly water balloon beach castle competition is about to start. Kids against parents. Start building your sand castles now. Castles are done. Now get out your water balloons. Our castle is great. We are going to win. <laughs> yeah, they're just little kids. Was amazing. The kids win this award. <laughs> Congratulations, kids. You won fair and square. Let's play in the castle some more. Can I hold the award now, Marvel? Look, 
pirate fill. It's a treasure. So? So? We are pirates, Pirate Phil. And what do pirates love? That's right. Treasures. <laughs> but they have a giant sandcastle, Pirate Maurice. Yes. But we have a water balloon cannon. the castle, I'll go get the water balloons. Daddy, we need more water balloons. The pirates won our award. <gasps> we don't have any more water balloons. But we can fill up these with water. Yeah, or this. And he's making a storm. We need to find it before its mischief gets out of hand. Oh no! I think it went that way.
The path is blocked. Not in my city. Stop the storm! It must not be able to hear me through the storm. Atmo! You need to... Oh, oh no! Atmo, I know you like playing with the weather, but that was dangerous. Okay, this one should go. Morphle! Morph into a logging machine! Cut that tree, Morphle!
Yesterday's big storm pulled out many trees. If trees aren't rooted properly, they can just fall down all of a sudden. And that can be very dangerous. <laughs> Morpho loves cutting down trees. Oh no! Look! Tumbling test tubes! Are you okay, Professor Rashid? This is my latest invention. Everything I zap with it becomes very big or very small. Ah, great! Ah, Morpho got the tree. Morphe cut way too many trees. My beautiful forest is gone. Where are the forest animals going to live now? It will take years for these trees to grow back. Morphe, shall we? Wait, I have an idea. Professor Rashid, can we borrow your invention? Get the award for me. <laughs> Let's water this beautiful garden of ours, Barky. Hmm. Wait a second. This isn't a garden hose. It's a <laughs> snake. <laughs> <laughs> We are now the Scary Animal Bandits. We steal scary animals and release them in the city. But Stein, I thought we were... Shh! Release the tiger! Ah! Help! Oh no! We need to help them, Morpho. Morpho? Morpho no can help. Tiger scary. The tiger is scary for me too, Morphle. It is very dangerous. But you don't need to be afraid of the tiger because you can morph into something big. So the tiger is scared of you instead. Yeah! I know just what would scare a tiger. Look! A big T-Rex! Of course, but you should still do it, because if you do something a lot, you won't be scared anymore. <laughs> Yay! Now let's scare all the other animals out of the city. <laughs> Did you hear that, 
These scary animals are making sure everyone in the city stays inside so that we can execute our real plan. Yeah, <laughs> we are actually the Fruit Bandits. An apple a day keeps the doctor away. So if we eat all the fruit in the city, we don't ever have to go to the doctor again. Ooh, and the doctor is really scary. Ooh. We need to stop them. Morph into a big crocodile. <laughs> a big, dangerous crocodile! Bandits, you don't need to steal all that fruit. I used to be scared of the doctor, but I went anyway. And now, I'm not scared of the doctor at all. Because if you do something a lot, you won't be scared anymore. Really? Hello, there you are. Please follow me inside. He's not scary at all, Stein. 